question. Is a boombox considered asynchronous or synchronous learning? It's hard to say. Another question. Is this, uh, is this lit? Is this video lit? No? Okay, well, here's what I have to say for you today. Today, we didn't want you to miss us too much, so we made you this little video. And we also wanted to explain what this asynchronous day is gonna look like on your end, so that you don't have to go pester the parentals and ask them a bunch of questions, or maybe give them a little fib that you don't have any school to do today, okay? So let's look at what you're gonna be doing in math. And then after, if you have any questions, you can reach me in the inbox because I will definitely be on the computer like a maniac today. Okay, let's check it out. So let me give you a little preview of what you're gonna be doing today. You're gonna be working through a self-paced Nearpod. In the Nearpod, you're gonna see little, <laughs> little fraction um, activities where you're gonna be actually drawing on some of the models that we've already created for you to make it nice and easy on a computer. And then when you get to the next page, you're going to see the answer revealed. That way you can kind of go back and forth if you're confused to see if you got it right or to fix it. And that way you're kind of getting help as you go along. You'll continue through lots of those little kinds of activities, but you're also going to see little videos. And those videos, some of them do not have audio um, because we made them when we were in a classroom where everyone could hear but it will walk you through the steps for adding and subtracting with fractions and mixed numbers in case you forgot how to do that. And you're only gonna get one problem from each of those operations, so it's not extremely long. If you're a kid that already remembers how to do the skill, we're fine with you skipping the tutorial video, but don't skip the tutorial video and then do terribly on the uh, assignment. We are gonna take a grade on it. Um, and then last but not least, there will be a tiny little quiz at the very, very end. And in that quiz, you will see um, just five questions. They're pretty easy. We will take it for a grade. Now, that said, I know some of you are probably really looking forward to having this asynchronous day. And if you choose to just like go ride your bike around the town or pet your dog all day or whatever you want to do, that's totally fine. We just ask that you do get this assignment done by Monday. So you do have work to do, um, but you have the choice to decide when you want to do it. Just don't forget about it. And it will take you a little longer than a normal play posit. So we want to give you like some flexibility, but we also don't want it to just be like a snow day, okay? And that's kind of why we made you a Nearpod that has all this um, interactivity built into it so that your parents don't have to help you and you know exactly what it is that you need to do and you can look to see if you're on the right track. So like everything you need is built in. Why? Because we love you. And I know you're gonna miss us. And so then I'm not even gonna give you a rap or a song or anything. If you miss us too much, you can just watch this video <laughs> over and over. I know that's not gonna happen. I'm a realist now. This year has taught me. Romantic, no more. Realist. Okay, have a great day and good luck with your math assignment.